Meu chocolate contra seu revólver. What's up, guys? Let's start this one with a disclaimer. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Since some of you don't read last time, I am free to play. And I have ever been free to play in this goddamn game. And I only have 60% damage deposit. In fact, hold my beer. I can solo this with way less. Okay, you can't remove damage from the costumes, they are permanent, whatever. But let's do it with 32% now. I'll begin while also giving you tips, like number 1, this game is not very original, it's just like Pokemon. Water hits double against fire, that's it. Then just make sure you don't get killed by dodging the shiny orange stuff well animated by a 11 year old and we're done all right and for the smart ass out there that think that i'm getting buffed by someone before doing it think again that's completely solo if i had buffs i would hit way harder like lord zaur etc for the second boss Pro tip number 2, just like Pokemon, again, use Ghost against Ghost, Mogwai cards etc, the accessory ones. Also, when he starts charging this attack, just turn around, wait a bit, etc. Because sometimes you can kill it fast enough, sometimes you don't. The third floor is a combination of a DPS check and an IQ test. There are 5 zones in the deck and 3 tentacles in phase 2. Where do you think you need to be to not get stuck? If you answer with where there is no tentacles, you're correct. If not, then you're the bane of my existence. The boss is completely neutral, so just like Pokemon, don't use Ghost, it doesn't hit neutral. Bring it to 70%. Kill the second boss, the one that spawns. Take the orange arm, then hit the heart with dark arrows since it's a holy heart. And then finish the job against the boss. This run I was weaker because I am using divine in my weapon for life steal and that DPS don't do damage. Now, while I take everything back to my goddamn adventure book, why don't you like and subscribe, huh? Next time, I might do something different, like soloing with a fucking knife. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again.